Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I guess I hit him. I mean, he, he was keeled over. I don't know, unless he died of a, unless he had a heart attack or a stroke or something. What's up, Plane Crash Survivors? This is KJ48, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play for The Forest. And this is not just any Let's Play for The Forest. The Forest is now full release. Now, I know last season I said that The Forest was full release, but I was wrong. It was not full release, but it is now officially fully released. This is freaking awesome. They've done a lot in this update. I'm going to talk about a couple of the key points as we play, but let's get started. I'm freaking hyped. Let's go. New game. All right, so uh, normal, hard, hardcore survival. Yeah, let's go normal. I like normal. Okay, one of the um, one of the changes. I'm not even sure if this is a change or if this is the way it's always been, but calories are now considered positive. C calories are now always considered positive and lead to gaining strength, unless in hard survival difficulty mode. So in other words, in this normal mode, I don't really have to worry about calories. I mean, I guess I have to eat. Uh, to keep myself from starving, but I don't really have to worry about calories, which is really kind of weird, because I thought normal that would have been a good um, that would have been a good survival aspect for normal. I don't really consider that like hardcore survival. I think that should be in the regular game, but you know, it is what it is. We don't have to worry about calories. We just have to keep ourselves from starving to death. Okay, run speed now is slightly increased with athletic skill levels. So now not only will we be able to run for longer, but you will be able to um, run a little faster. All right, let's go. I didn't know I had to pick this up. I thought the cutscene would just start. For Timmy. Aw, oh, little, little Timmy. What's up, little Timmy? Hold on to your little He-Man. Oh, something's going wrong, little Timmy. It's, it's over. It's it, We're done for. We're done for, kid. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. I told you. I told you. Get on your... Get back. Get back. Oh, man. Uh... I feel bad for this kid. And then I'll forget about him, like, by, by episode two, you know? <laughs> oh, boy. Here we go. We're going down. Full release, baby. That's right. Okay. Crash already, man. Damn. How long does it take for this plane to crash? Okay. <sighs> I gotta remember to look up this time. There we go. Oh, look at that little, little red weirdo. Hey, get away from my kid, red weirdo. Hey, you. Don't eat my kid! Why would, he, why would he take my kid? There's more meat on me. I think there's other reasons he's taking him. Alright, let's get started. Let's see where we are. Let's get up. Let's get our hunger taken care of. Let's get our, our, our health back. You know, gotta take care of the basics. And then we're gonna go out and see where we are. Oh boy. I wasn't really happy about having to restart, guys. But I pretty much knew I was going. I was gonna have to. It's just, you know... I mean, that's the way it is, guys. Uh, these early access games, you got to restart, especially for a full release like this. You know, I actually played my game and it seemed okay. And some people said I might not have to restart. But there's been some changes on where things are found. Um, like they move the cockpit uh, into the snow area. So I figured it would be better to restart. All right. Um, should I get stuff? Yeah, let's get some. Let's get some items first. Then we're gonna take our bearings. I've got an idea where I want to build. Um, it's on the side of a cliff again. But then I was thinking maybe I should just build out in the middle of the woods somewhere. That'd be really scary, right? I'm not really sure if I want to build on the side of a cliff or out in the woods. And one thing I'm thinking about is I don't think I'm gonna do the rock wall right away because the rocks are the rock wall is so freaking expensive to build. I mean, I came nowhere near finishing it last season. Um, so I'm thinking may maybe make a wood wall and then, uh, we'll make a rock wall surrounding that one later on. Give us, you know, I don't know. I know the rock wall is tougher. It's going to be harder for the, for the mutants to break down. And that, that makes sense. But at the same time, man, like that rock wall, oh boy, takes forever. Um, oh, one of the other things in this update, um, upgrades can now be placed, uh, can now be placed automatically replacing the fiddly old system. So I'm not really sure exactly what that means. I have a pretty good idea where I am. I'm pretty much where the boat is. Okay. So let's go to the cannibal camp. First things first, let's go to the cannibal camp and get some supplies. And then I'm going to have to make a decision. I'm thinking about taking you guys to where I'm thinking about building and then maybe going and looking for another spot. I'm not really sure. Uh, the indecisiveness is, is terrible. But um, first things first, we got to go to the cannibal camp. Um, oh, wow. Oh, look at this. This is one thing with the update when you mouse over stuff. Kind of kind of moves around a little bit so that's pretty cool yeah it's nice nice little feature 
Uh, let me take a look at my options very quickly. Let me take a look at the graphics. Um, yeah, I'm on original color grading. When I was uh, when I was playing yesterday, kind of like you know looking around on my other world after the update, um, the game looked very dark. So I might change the color grading a little bit. But now it looks good. So I don't know. Maybe it was just a little bit too close to night when I was playing yesterday. Oh my goodness, my stamina. Let's take a look at our stats really quick. See where they start off with. Oh, they changed this. Hold on, they changed this. I should probably look at this at night though. Not a good time to look at it now. All right, so we're at 20 strength, 20 athleticism, 205. Okay. All right, you know what? You know what I think the first thing we need to do is? Let's make a... Let's make a spear. Can we hold more than one spear? They said something about... No, you know what? There's a spear bag. So you can hold more than one spear, but you gotta, you gotta put it in the spear bag. All right, so... Uh, we'll do this. Wait, why did that go in the bag automatically? Aren't I supposed to be able to control... Oh, oh, there we go. One. No. Aren't you supposed to be able to put that in the middle and click what you want it to be, or... Um, combine. One. Is that... Did that do it? No. All right, I'm gonna have to mess around with that. It's not letting me change the, uh... Or at least it's not letting me change the way I used to. Or maybe... Maybe that is the way I used to change. Honestly, I haven't set up the key bindings, uh, in, like, a few weeks, so I don't remember exactly how I did it, but I'll play around with that off-camera. You don't need to sit around and watch me fuddle around with that. Oh, here we go. Okay, dear. Whoa, missed him. I think I missed him bad. You really gotta aim low. Yeah. But yeah, let's try it. We gotta get this guy. This guy's gonna feed us for a couple days. Come on, stop running. Oh, you freaking punk ass deer. I hate you! Did that one go right off the cliff? Yeah, I don't know. It might have. Alright, whatever. Alright, well, let's make another one in case we find another deer. There we go. Okay. Oh, there we go. Hold on. I gotta get one of these guys. Just when I'm, like, done and I don't want to mess with them anymore. They freaking come right around. Alright, come on. Stop running. That's got him. Beautiful! That was a good shot. That yeah, was a good shot. Oh, look at that. I just killed you in front of your, I don't know, nephew. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> Alright, so let's grab that meat. So we got all the meat right there. That's good. Okay, good start. Good start. Alright, we should probably get some more. Oh, by the way, I don't even bother looking for the spears anymore. They don't break or anything. They don't go away. They're just, like, impossible to find. Like, once you've hit the deer, it's just like, eh, I don't even want to bother. <laughs> So, guys, what do you think? Should I live on the side? I don't know why I'm asking you, because I'm probably going to make the decision before you can answer. But I'm still curious what you think. Um, live on the side of a cliff or live in the middle of the woods. I kind of want... What I want to do is... I want to find I want to find the middle of the woods, a nice dense area. Okay, before we do anything, let's go ahead and make a marker. What I want to do is I want to find a really dense... Oh, look at these pictures. They look so much nicer. I want to find a really dense area of the woods. And what what is what was that? Weapon display. Oh, Okay. I'm sorry, I keep getting distracted. Anyway, I want to find a really dense area of the wood, of the woods where I've, there's a lot of wood in the area, and I want to just um, I want to like just blow up all the trees and make my wall, make a wooden wall, and then uh, eventually I'll I'll like make a, a stone wall on the outside of the wooden wall. Maybe I'll even connect it somehow. Uh, orange is fine with that. I'm okay with that. So we can always find our way back here if we need to. All right, all right. So let's come on in here, grab the dynamite. Boom goes the dynamite. Grab that. Grab that. Are we full on sodas? Yeah, we are. Alright, let's grab some of this. I don't want to be in here for too long because uh, I haven't saved the game yet. As a matter of fact, once I get out of here and get back in the woods, I'm gonna I'm gonna save the game. Let's do that right now. Let's get out of here. I don't feel I don't feel right. I don't feel right being here, man. I don't feel right being here. <laughs> what we could do is we can make that temporary shelter. Alright, let's get out of here. All right, this is a good spot to make the temporary shelter. All right, so storage, food, shelters, temporary shelter. We'll just go ahead and make that right here, just so we can save. And can we? I think I thought we used to be able to hold down the button to build these things, but I guess not. Maybe that was in a dream. Maybe there's a dream I had. All right, come on, come on. We need some more sticks. Sticks. Sticks for days! Let's get some sticks, people. We gotta save this game. Oh, boy. I don't like these early days, man. I feel I feel weak and underpowered. I feel like if the uh, cannibals find me, I'm in trouble. 
I mean, let's face it, I probably am. We're going to save over our old game. Confirm. All right, so I want you to have an idea where I'm going to... I was going to actually run there off camera, but I want you to have an idea where I'm going to be in the game. So there's the cannibal camp that I was at last uh, last season. And the place I'm going to stay at is going to be over here. What we're going to do is we're going to follow the cliff side. And there's going to be two cliff sides. And then there's going to be... Oh, God. All right, all right. Hold your horses. Hold your horses, guys. All right, let's try and avoid these guys if we can, but I don't know if we're going to be able to. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy. we got to find the uh, water. Where's my, um... Oh, there it is. Did I get turned around in here? Yeah, I did. I got turned around. The water's that way. All right, I got to find the water, and then I'm going to use the, um... I'm going to use the edge of the ocean to get to where I'm going to build. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Let's stay away from these guys. My, my favorite early game weapon, in case you guys don't know, is the uh, axe lit on fire. I love lighting these pricks on fire, and uh, it's like the best thing in the world. So that's why I got that ready. All right, so there's going to be two cliff faces over here. There's going to be a cliff face going down to another lower cliff face, and then there's going to be a huge uh, chasm that goes over to another area that I think would be really cool to put a zip line there. Um, it might even be a good... No, actually, I was over there earlier. It was, it's not a good place to get logs, but it might be a good place to build. Um, yeah, I think this is the first cliff face. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so this is the cliff face I want to build on for the first part of the base. Then I want part of the base to be down there. And then there's a big freaking chasm here to go over to that side. Um, I might not build over there though. There's no, there's no real reason to. I might I might put the um, I might put the zip line there though because it might be fun. So all right, so this is where we're gonna start. Should I build? Should I start building up here or down there? I think I'm gonna start building up here. Because I'm going to start building the walls. I think the... I, not, not, I'm not going to start building the walls. But when I do build the walls, I think they're going to start probably here. Yeah, probably here. Or maybe even over here. Yeah, maybe like right around here. Oh, God, don't fall. Don't fall. All right, right around here. And then they're probably going to... I don't want this uh, big stupid stump in, in my base. Because I tried to break it, you can't break it. So I'm thinking the wall is going to come over here. Probably turn about right here. And turn around over here. Somewhere over here. Probably about right here, maybe. Alright, the inside the inside of the wall is going to be the first thing I put up. It is going to be wood. Then I'm going to make a stone outside. And the idea, with the, the, the idea is I'm going to have a stone outside wall and a wooden inside wall. And I want them to be perfectly uh, aligned apart. So I can build a staircase in between them and use it as a walkway. Um, I don't know if I could... I guess I could do it as a staircase. There might be an easier way. I'm not really sure, but that's the idea. So, uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and build some basics here for early game survival. We're going to need a hunting shelter... Alright, that's a good spot for it. Yep, okay. We're also going to need a drying rack. What is that under? Is that under, um... Drying rack. I forget what that's under. Did I just pass it? It should be under storage, right? Hold on, let's see. Let's get, nah, it's gonna be back here. Weapon racks, uh, log side stick hold. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we're gonna have to do this. Maybe we should stay in a tree. You know what? We should probably stay in a tree. For the first part of the build. Just like we did last time, right? It's a good way to protect all your stuff. Maybe stay in a tree down here. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Can we get it done in time? Sure, why not? Alright, let's try that. Alright, oh boy, we gotta look for a way to skirt down here without dying. Oh, this might not be really good. Up, 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 up. Yeah! Alright. Alright, so let's find a tree down here. None of these trees look that good. Ah, oh, these trees suck. This tree's pretty good. It's really far away, though. Ugh, it's really far away. I don't like where it is. This tree, again, is good, but I don't like it on the side of the cliff. Um, These trees might be pretty good. Ugh. I kind of like... Eh. I don't like the, the rock be at the bottom of this one. None of these are that good. All right, guys. Here's my plan. All right. So, I got a treehouse over here. All right. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to build the platform out in front like I did last time. Then I'm going to put another tree platform right here. And then that's where I'm going to put all my drying racks and stuff. But um, that's going to take a while. That's not going to be done today. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a temporary storage right here. I'm going to get that done, number one. And then uh, we'll, we'll take it from there. All right, this tree behind it uh, needs to come out. Um, I don't know if it needs to come out permanently, but it definitely needs to come out. Also, 
I made a I made a uh, sitting bench somewhere. I don't know where I put it, but um, it's gonna be a nice place for me to sit. Uh, what was that I just ate? Snack. Great. Well, I kind of need it, I guess. We need to get that drying rack done. All right. Well, let's let's get the uh, let's get the area let's get a place to save before we do the drying rack. Actually, the drying rack would be even way easier than the place to save. I'm not really sure. All right. Let's go ahead and get some stamina back. Oh boy. All right. Chop this sucker down. Come on down. Man, where's my chainsaw, right? So I wonder what else they moved, right? Because I know they moved the cockpit, but I didn't see anything else. But the update notes were extensive, and I really didn't like have the time to go through them all. So I'm not really sure what else they moved, if anything. If you guys know what, what else they moved, let me know. And um, we'll probably do some cave exploring um, to see what's what. Oh, there's my sitting thingy. We'll probably do some cave exploring to see what's what. And, uh, you know... We'll just kind of look around and see what we can find, right? I mean, that, that's this is like the age of discovery, man. When like stuff's been moved and you don't know where it is, and you know that is pretty neat. All right, so that's good right there. Let's go ahead and build this. I've actually got the food on me, and it is going bad. So let's get this drying rack up as soon as possible. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. There we go. I would like some lights. Um, I want to put lights up this season. Like, I didn't put a lot of lights up last season. And I don't know why I have a leg in my freaking inventory. I don't know where I got that from, but I don't need that. Anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, last season I did not get a lot of lights up because, you know, uh, lights attract the enemy. So, it's, it's like a catch-22. You put the lights up because you want to work at night. But at the same time, once the lights are up, you can't work at night because, you know... The freaking cannibals are up in your business. So who needs that, right? Alright, so let's go ahead and chop down some trees. Alright guys, I went ahead and slept through the night. Let's take a look at our food. Um, it looks kind of dry, but... Nah, eh, it's still raw. Still raw. Alright, well let's put that up there. That's why we have, candle That's why we have candy bars. Alright, so let's go ahead and have a delicious... A delicious uh, <laughs> breakfast of candy bars and soda. And let's take a look at our stats really quick, because I don't, I don't think I feel like I look at enough of my stats. Why am I so bloody? It's kind of weird, right? I look kind of bloody. Anyway, um, so these are going up again. Um, I don't think that being well-fed really matters. I think you just have to not starve. And in this normal mode, that, that stuff will go up. Okay, so there's a couple things we need There's a couple things we need today. I'd like to get a rain catch. Um, also, I'd like to get some rope, okay? Because you can see right here, we still need some rope for this thing. I've been doing some work during the night, but we still need some rope. I also put up the other thing over here where I'm going to put the uh, drying rack. Um, I'm going to try and fit a couple drying racks on that one. But let's head back, let's head back to the cannibal camp. And um, I did save before I passed the night, so that is fine. We're going to head back to the cannibal camp. We will keep our, our eyes peeled for deer. And we also need to get some rabbits. Now, do I want to go trying to get... You know what? Maybe I should make the slingshot. I don't think I ever made it. Is the slingshot in the book? Let's take a look at the book. I actually never did that. I was supposed to do it at night. All right. Back to page one. Okay. Um, so, it tells you about blueberries, foraging. Got that. Oh, hold on. Let's go back to the... Wait, no. <laughs> I just want to go back to the beginning of the book. Where's page one? I'm guessing this is page one. Nope, there's one before this. All right, there's page one. Okay, so the shelter tells you about uh, the fire, some berries. Um, is that it? Uh, To-do list, stats, crafting guide. Let's take a look at the crafting guide. All right, so this tells you how to craft, okay? So that's pretty cool. Um, okay, it tells you all about the blueberries and the mushrooms and stuff and the other flowers. Uh, oh, once you get the once you get a, a thing, I think it pops up on the screen like it's a little, like a little checklist. Same thing when you see animals. Okay, that's that's cool, but it's not really that helpful. All right, so I don't. I guess there's no crafting crafting list. Anyway, um, yeah, we need to make the uh, we need to make a lot of stuff with the crafting list, but I'm gonna have to look that stuff up. Um, yeah, yeah, for sure. Slingshot. Damn, I really actually I'll probably do that in between cuts because I really kind of want to know. Uh, we should make the bow, right? We need some... We need rope. Yeah, well, let's get some rope. Let's get some rope. That's what we really need. Not having rope is uh, is holding us back. Because if I can make the bow, um, I can start killing some rabbits. Although you guys told me slingshots are better against the rabbits. So, I'll try both. I didn't try slingshots at all last season. So, I should do it now. Alright. Let's come through here. We still gotta grab... Uh, still gotta grab lots of cloth. Alright, nothing here I care about. Well, the gas, but I'm not going to get that chainsaw for a little bit. I don't know. Maybe I will. I, I don't mind going to get the chainsaw and all the other items if they haven't been moved. But the problem is nobody watched those videos, so I guess people don't really care. <laughs> um, I thought they would have done well, but I don't know. I guess people already know about it. It's like old news. So, 
All right, let's go ahead and break this. Uh, I did use some of my, I did use some of my bottles to strengthen my act, my plane axe. When you put it in the middle, you can see right there. It tells you exactly what you need. Now this is kind of weird, right? Because this says the feathers give you speed. The teeth give you damage and less speed. And the booze gives you damage. So why would you ever use the teeth? Because like, why would you want to lower the speed? You know? So that seems kind of weird. So I actually put some booze in there. You can see it's got little shards of broken glass on the axe now. So that's pretty sweet. Come on. Come on. Damn it. Hit the freaking case. You know what I want you to do. Gotta get some more, um, get some more candy bars too. Would be nice. Yeah, we came here for rope. I'm so excited because of, you know, new freaking, the game's officially launched. I'm, I'm freaking hyped. I'm forgetting what I came here for. Alright, so no more. There is some more rope in one of these huts. I just don't remember which one. I should probably save my stamina in case the enemy shows up because I will run. I'm, I'm not above running. Ooh, flares. Nice. Gotta get that flare gun. Now, the cockpit has definitely been moved. They said that. So, that was actually in the update notes. Oh, look at this. Oh, cool. It's in what the new cave entrances look like. Oh, that's neat. I like that. I could probably knock down that skull thing, but I'm going to leave it there. Um, for when I actually need skulls. Alright, come on, man. Where's this rope? I thought there was some rope in one of these. I, I don't know. I wonder if they took it out. Yeah, see, there was rope here before, too. Although, I don't think you could grab that rope. Huh, that's interesting. Did I just I might have just missed the tent. But, oh boy, they're over there. They are over there. Um, I think I, I might have just missed the tent, but I don't, I don't know, man. I'm, I don't... I don't know. I don't know. Well, we know that there's rope. Oh, maybe it's in the side tent over here, right? Was it in this one? No, I already went in that one. All right, well, we're going to go over here because uh, where I was building last time, there was a tent right next to me, and it always had rope. So if there's no rope in there, then that means they either, um, the game's either, like, you know, missing stuff. You know, there's still bugs in the game, I'm sure. Or they took the rope out. Honestly, neither would surprise me. All right, let's be quiet. No, there's rope here. All right. What is this? Oh, that's closed. That's right. There's like certain... There's like clothes in the game now. That's cool. I like that. Is that what this is? Yeah, clothing outfit. Blue jeans and gray shirt. I don't know what it really does for me because, you know, it's not like I can see myself, but... Oh, what the hell? Where are the freaking flares, bro? Oh, lame. Lame. All right, let's go get a turtle. All right, guys. I came down here to the beach to get some... Uh, to get some turtle shells, and I also am picking up throwable small rocks. Uh, because I do have what I need for the slingshot. Um, I looked it up, so uh, we'll make that today. We'll make that today. That'll be the last thing we do, though. Let me see if I can get a turtle here. We don't have a lot We don't have a, lo a lot of time left on the video, though, so... Um, if I don't get a turtle soon, I'll just pause it. But if you're, worrying, if you're wondering where to get turtles, this is a great place to get turtles. They, oh, there's one. I see one right now. Oh, you're not going to make it back into the water, my friend. Cut his freaking head. Take him apart. And then you got the shell. Now you can make yourself a water catch. You also got some turtle meat. Although I couldn't carry it because I killed a deer earlier. So now I guess I'm full. So, alrighty. Alright, guys. I'll see you back at base. Alright, so what I'm thinking is... I'm thinking I build up there. And I make my happy birthday trap defense down here. I think that's a pretty good idea. So if I'm up there and like the, the you know cannibals start coming up and you know acting a fool, I can always come down here. Maybe um, yeah, maybe like right here, I could just make the happy birthday trap setup. Could probably do that. Could probably do that. And by the way, over there is where I want to make the zip line to over there. Now the zip line going over there would be completely pointless. I just think it'd be cool. So it's something I want to do, but we're not going to worry about that right now. Let's go ahead and make the slingshot. See if we can catch some rabbits because we need rabbit skins for quite a few things. So the slingshot is stick, cloth, and duct tape. Piece of cake. All right. So let's go ahead and grab that. And how do we... Okay. So we do that. Can I, can I click off of it without having to shoot it? I guess not. Um, so where that, where did that thing go? Does it... Where'd the rock go? I, I can't get it back or... I don't know. Whatever. I did see a couple rabbits over here, so let's see if we can grab them. I don't think this is going to be easier for me than the than the bow, but... Some people were saying they like the slingshot, so let's give it a shot. <laughs> Literally. 
Alright, so let's see if we can find some wabbits. Some wascally wabbits. You can't get that close to them. That's for damn sure. Alright, rabbits, where are you? So they run up this hill or what? I think they ran up the hill. Let's take a look. Okay, I see one. Oh boy, this is going to be tough. He was walking to the right. I don't know if he stopped. They're really hard to see in this grass. Yeah, I'm not seeing him anymore. There he is. Is that him? I don't think so. Yeah, it is, because I just got a new animal discovery. I bet you was, that was a rabbit. And he ran. Ugh. It's hard to see with this thing, too. I can't really see too much. Um, it's very difficult. Right, let's see if we can get this guy. There he is. No, I don't like this thing. Oh, he wasn't even there. Yeah, he is. Did I hit him? Did I seriously hit him? <laughs> okay, well, you know. There we go. That's one. I um, think I should probably set up some rabbit traps at some point. Maybe even sooner rather than later. Like, maybe next video? I don't know. Maybe. What, what is this tree? I can't tell. Oh, it's got red, black. No, you don't want to eat that. You definitely don't want to eat that. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I guess I hit him. I mean, he, he was keeled over. I don't know. Unless he died of a... Unless he had a heart attack or a stroke or something. <laughs> I can't freaking see them, though. Like, And is there any way to undo this once you've done it? I don't know. Let's try this. See, once you shoot it, I think the I think the stone's gone no matter what, which is not really cool, especially considering once you pull the thing back, you can't undo it. Maybe I should try in the sun. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time spotting the rabbits. I mean, I I know where I can go to spot rabbits. Um, this just seems like a really difficult area. So. Anyway, guys, uh, this is going a little bit long. Uh, I'm going to hunt some more rabbits off camera, but I am going to call this one here, guys. Are you guys excited for the new release? Are you playing it on console? Are you playing it on um, on the PC? What, what, what do you got? What do you got going on, guys? What do you got going on? Let me know in the comments. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.